Welcome back everyone. It's a new year, so what does that mean? It will be a new experience here at Pines. I'm Nia Seymour, and sadly it's my last week here at Pines. But let's make the best of it. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may not be seated. Today is Monday, January 8th, 2024. New Year and a new today in history with Catherine. Thank you, Neil. Welcome back, Patriots. In today's history, on January 8th, 2010, these rare cylinder-shaped snowballs are formed in very snowy weather. But the weather has to have a perfect amount of snow, ice, wind, moisture, and temperature. The interesting part is that the snowballs formed all by themselves. They were first spotted by a man and his wife. He explained that it was a spectacular sight to see. Wow, I hope I can see a self-rolled snowball one day. They're so cute. Now let's go tomorrow for today's tasty lunch. Thank you, Catherine. Today's lunch is chicken tenders, turkey cheese deluxe hoagie, tater tots, cucumber, garden side salad, mandarin oranges, and your taste of milk. Students, please keep in mind the lunch will change at any time and to always bring the lunch card. And don't forget to inform your teachers if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit, and let's go back to Nia. Thank you, Samara. Man, I had the best winter break ever. So first I, never mind, that's a story for another day. Let's continue. Tomorrow, third and fourth graders will have their chance to go to the Patriot store. The store is open from 7.15 to 7.55 a.m. Make sure to come on time. Patriots, keep your phone shut down and in your backpacks at all times. And there's no chewing gum in school. Please spit it out before entering the building. Today's the deadline for the winter break green dot challenge. Whoever completed it will have an epic lunch with Pat the Patriot. Did you do the green dots? I hope you all did your instructional software challenge over the break because our challenge ends on the 19th. Don't fret, you still have time. The time for the color run is almost here. It will be from the 18th through the 19th, so make sure to donate funds in order to go to the spectacular fun. And for whoever funds the most, they get a super awesome prize. Testing is back, and for tomorrow's lucky test grades, our kindergarten taking the star reading, and sixth grade will take their fast reading. Isn't that great? Make sure you all study. Let's shine on Camila for today's weather. Happy New Year's Patriots! Today's weather is 77 degrees Fahrenheit with rainy sunny skies. Make sure to bring an umbrella. In other weather news, NASA's X-ray observatory spotted something bizarre in the form of a Christmas tree. And this was a star cluster. Did you know that this spectacular phenomenon is a group of stars that are near each other? When seen from Earth, the stars appear to be close together in a pattern of a Christmas tree, but they might actually be nowhere near each other. Amazing how an event like this can bring a Christmas tree into space. Now let's wish our Patriots happy birthday with Giselle. Thank you, Camilo. Today's birthday boys and girls are Jose Aguirre, Andrew Liu, and Carson Steele. And our belated teacher birthday is Ms. Valdez. Sorry, Ms. Valdez, there was technical difficulties. Happy birthday, now let's go back to Nia. Thank you, Jose. Patriots, here are practice citations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly to others, treat the schools well respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Ms. Greg, Ms. Drayden, Ms. M. Williams, Ms. Arnold, Ms. Danqua, and Ms. Valdez for getting the correct answer to Friday's daily challenge, which was, what has six faces and 21 eyes? The correct answer was a dice, but technically the correct answer is a die. Today's daily challenge is, Daily Challenge. What is the largest planet in our solar system? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance.gmail.com before 9 a.m. or order for your answer to be reviewed. When does it be announced on the next morning announcements? Everyone at IBT would like to wish you all a Money Monday. Have a new day!